Since its inception back in 1973, the Global Positioning System, commonly known as GPS, has been long dominated by the United States given that it was invented by the US Department of Defense specifically for military applications during the Cold War era. However, with China's rapid rise as an economic and technological superpower on the global stage, its own homegrown Baidu navigation satellite system has emerged as a formidable contender in recent years, challenging American supremacy when it comes to satellite navigation technology and threatening the GPS monopoly that has existed for decades. As Baidu continues to expand ambitiously under state-backed Chinese initiatives like the Belt and Road Initiative, experts believe it may soon rival and even surpass the US GPS in coverage, accuracy, and technological capabilities. In this video analysis, we will make an in-depth up-to-date comparison in 2023 between the American GPS, which has clearly held dominance historically since the 1970s, versus China's new rising Baidu navigation system across various critical parameters. By evaluating key metrics like the number of satellites launched, monitoring infrastructure deployed, navigation precision provided, and future development plans, we will determine who currently leads in this strategically important domain of global navigation satellites and the far-reaching geopolitical implications this dominance promises over the next decade between the two superpowers. When China first kicked off its Baidu satellite navigation program in the early 1990s, it was envisioned as a relatively small regional system meant to provide coverage primarily across the Chinese mainland. However, over the past decade, China has greatly expanded the ambitions and scale of the Baidu positioning system, launching satellites at an unprecedented pace that dwarfs the American GPS program. As of 2023, the Baidu constellation consists of over 56 medium Earth orbit satellites, nearly twice as many when compared to the 31 satellite GPS system operated by the US. This enormous expansion gives China's Baidu navigation system much wider and comprehensive coverage, especially across the entire Asia-Pacific region. Compared to GPS with ground stations only in the US, China has installed over 10 times as much monitoring and control infrastructure for Baidu spread right across Asia, Africa, Latin America, and even Antarctica to bolster performance. With advanced positioning technology and extensive ground support, the reported accuracy of Baidu signals is now superior to that of GPS by a big margin in Eastern Hemisphere regions far away from American soil. By launching inter-satellite link connectivity between its navigation satellites, China also ensures robust performance for Baidu even over vast oceanic expanses, where ground station contact is minimal. Such rapid enhancements make it evident that China aims to extend Baidu coverage globally shortly, positioning it as a true alternative to rivals and outperforming GPS on an international scale beyond just domestic use. With reported test results showing centimeter level precision, Chinese officials ambitiously proclaim plans to achieve global real-time centimeter grade positioning, timing, and navigation services for Baidu users worldwide by 2035. Presenting a direct competitive challenge to displace the American GPS system as the de facto standard in this crucial technology sphere. Owing to China's substantial investments and rapid deployment of cutting-edge technology in its satellites and control systems, the capabilities of the Baidu navigation system significantly outpaces that of the US GPS in several crucial aspects. By leveraging the latest advances in areas like quantum physics and satellite laser, ranging in its orbital fleet and monitoring stations, Baidu can reputedly pinpoint a user's location down to a very precise centimeter level of horizontal and vertical accuracy within China itself. In comparison, civilian GPS receivers still struggle to achieve beyond an accuracy figure of a few meters due to technology limitations. Another unique feature of the Baidu 3.0 satellites that the American GPS sorely lacks is two-way short message communication functionality, which does not rely on cellular signals. This allows special Baidu-equipped devices to send out emergency messages and alerts to Chinese controllers during crises like natural disasters, greatly aiding rescue operations. 
With frequent launches of new and improved Baidu satellites, featuring the latest national advances every year, China likely has a decisive edge in rapidly upgrading capabilities over the slower-paced legacy GPS satellite deployment cycle, promising sustained long-term dominance. With China aggressively promoting its Baidu technology and providing heavy subsidies for its adoption overseas, especially among developing countries across Asia and Africa, the proliferation of its navigation system carries deep geopolitical implications. As more countries get reliant on Baidu for key infrastructure, China gains tremendous soft power advantage and diplomatic influence leveraging the superiority and reliability of its precision technology internationally, while the US risks losing allies. Chinese state-championed corporations also capture lucrative market share, displacing American dominance in navigation receivers and semiconductors using Baidu signals. Militarily, the People's Liberation Army reduces reliance on its perceived adversary's GPS system, which could get disrupted in times of war. Instead, China can ensure the precision strike capabilities of missiles and ships rely on Baidu without foreign dependency. With cutting-edge real-time 3D positioning and velocity measuring capabilities, Baidu challenges US forces operationally across domains like integrated joint operations and drone swarm attacks. In essence, by scaling Baidu globally, China aims to undermine American strategic influence just as GPS technology expanded US hegemony worldwide since the 1980s, heralding a new era of satellite navigation geopolitics in the 21st century, led from Beijing instead of Washington. However, despite China racing ahead of GPS capabilities in some respects, America's GPS continues to retain certain deeply ingrained structural advantages in the global navigation satellite industry, owing to its pioneering early mover status. The vast majority of existing navigation software, hardware systems, and global infrastructure, especially across aviation and shipping domains, have been predicated for decades on receiving trusted American GPS signals, which cannot feasibly transition overnight to China's encrypted Baidu, revealing limited access. With over 50 years of successful operation enabling innovations like Autoland, GPS also has unparalleled reliability credentials vital for safety-critical applications. Militarily, the US GPS satellites use advanced selective availability anti-spoofing modules and encryption on dedicated frequencies solely for American forces, promising greater security. Upcoming launches of new L5 band GPS satellites over this decade will incorporate cutting edge technologies like regional military grade navigation signals and SAR corrections substantially boosting location accuracy for civilian usage worldwide and helping retain parity with Baidu. Thus, while China races ahead on metrics, deep legacy integration disadvantages and American technology might help GPS retain structural advantages. In conclusion, China's Baidu system has remarkably transformed from its initial humble aspirations as a Chinese regional navigation network to now surpassing the capabilities of the once unchallenged global positioning system of the US in certain key parameters like location accuracy, emergency messaging, and rapid launch capabilities. However, decades of global integration mean GPS continues dominating satellite navigation currently with most existing infrastructure deeply predicated on only receiving its signals. So while an ambitious technology-leading Baidu threatens American dominance in isolated metrics, GPS seems poised to retain overall leadership for now, owing to its widespread trusted reputation and legacy ties with military and civilian systems worldwide. Yet with China expanding Baidu through accelerated satellite launches and advanced R&D, the competition for control in this strategically vital domain continues to heat up. Ultimately, the nation that succeeds in establishing the global standard for navigation satellite technology in the 21st century stands to reap enormous economic profits and geopolitical influence for decades to come from this infrastructure, high stakes that both superpowers continue vying intensely for.